Oh I god, wouldn't. don't let Morgan do that. <laughs> I really want to be able to dictate who shoots who. Um, that's important to me. Yes. Um, so, do you do the similar a similar thing with Finn? I think you do. You want the you want the range one. You you definitely don't want to be caught at range uh, range two of anything that Morgan's flying. No. Um, I think you just accept the the four dice and know that your your Fen can do four dice back yep. at, at range one. Yeah, exactly. Uh, five, yeah. Five, yes. Yeah. Yes, you're right. Um, so the issue in this match, I think, will be the Inquisitor um, because that will completely remove... Oh, hang on. So Inquisitor's uh, synergy with Concord Dawn Protector, does it count as range one? Do I trigger? No. No? That's been FAQ'd? That has been FAQ'd. Um, his attack counts as range one, but you do not count at, as being at range one sure. of the attacker okay. for the purposes of Concord Dawn. Right. Okay. So basically, um, the 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 Fang fighters here are going to have a hard time against the Inquisitor. I think that's going to be the the thing to remove uh, as quick as possible. Yeah. Um, otherwise, yeah, we're going to be in a world of hurt uh, because you can't get auto thrusters and unless you arrange one of the Inquisitor, you, yep. you won't be able to get um, uh, the, the bonus of aid either. So that's really interesting. Um, that is very, very interesting. This, uh, this Manaru configuration's actually got some nasty tools in it for, for Morgan. Mm. Uh, it's got ion projector, uh, rigged cargo chute, intel agent, and R4 agromech. Yeah. So, I mean, the standard ace play, I guess, would be to... Um, to cluster up the rocks as we were thinking that James would do last round. But yes. the issue with doing that now would be that uh, Tim can drop a rigged cargo chute off Manaru um, to, to completely block up a pathway that yes. he probably doesn't care about as much as uh, Morgan would. The thing is, I mean, everyone can take a stress from uh, a tiny mind link, mm -hmm. but um, as soon as one person gets a focus, I don't think anyone cares that much. Does that make sense? Yes. So, uh, whereas, I mean, you, we all know what happens to an actual ace with, without any tokens and a stress. Um, yeah. Double stressing the Inquisitor would be particularly disgusting. Um, yeah, it's going to be a really interesting match, this one. Mm -hmm. uh, I'm not entirely sure how Morgan will counter the asteroid deployment. Um, Tim's probably going to try and cluster it up anyway, um, so he can kind of scoot around the outside with Manaru or cut in drop an asteroid and, yeah. and bail out um we have a very standard uh inquisitor um a very yeah actually a completely standard list um on morgan's side um, the only thing w that morgan's lacking is he has no crew yep yeah. um he has no he has no space for it in, in terms of points so uh, he doesn't have the agent callus to just pick say a fen and get that free focus yeah and he's not countering with any kind of stress control like we saw in the last round that's right yeah so we've got a we've got a 99 point list uh, which I think is fantastic with Whisper, and I think um, uh, aces such as Whisper or Poe, in, in, uh, Intensity Poe, mm -hmm. the 99 is great because, I mean, if you drop it to 98 or 97, you can viably get to 96 or even lower with, uh, with a list such as Tim's with yes. not that much lost. Like, no, I think you could probably happily drop Iron Projector and Intelligence Agent off Manaru, yep. which would put you down to uh, uh, 93. And I, I think that would still have the tools to do well. E even uh, Dentel, uh, you can drop um, an extra munitions off Dengar and drop to 96 points-ish. Exactly, yeah. So I um, think uh, Imperials and, uh, and, and, I mean, Interceptor Rebels are in a funky position at the moment because they can't really play the initiative game as much as Scum can, yes. um, which is dangerous because but also kind of beneficial because now Whisper can be at 99 and doesn't really matter. There's not that many matches that will really dictate or, or punish her for mm -hmm. being in that particular, um, that particular point value. Mm. All right, so Tim's putting down his rock placement. He's gone relatively close with the debris to the, that center rock. Yeah. So he's mm. given Morgan initiative, which is, yeah, what I would have thought because that yep. means hopefully uh, Fen can outmaneuver Whisper. Um, I feel like Whisper still beats Fen though. I, th I think you're right. Mm. It, he's, Whisper's such a beast. Yeah. Um, and Morgan's incredibly good at playing her. Yeah, so we'll, we'll have to see. I mean, we, I mean, it, it's interesting because now this is the second uh, uh, Phantom match that we've had on the stream. Yep. Um, so Morgan's commentary last game was that uh, James is a much more aggressive um, phantom player than he is so it'll be interesting to see the disparity there uh, will Morgan kind of just 
go all guns blazing and token up and hope for the best or will he be more inclined to um you know uh, just make the most of that fire control system make the most of the evade token but from from a distance um so it's funny um morgan was actually discussing his his philosophy for how he approaches games on um on minoc earlier earlier this week and he was saying he like he prefers that um the slower approach castling for a couple of turns mm. just making get taking the opportunity to see how his opponent plays are they aggressive are they fast yeah. um so that helps to inform his decision making um in the, those critical turns absolutely when you're trying to decide your opponent has one of two different choices one is the the aggressive hard move one is the the, the safe conservative move what's the more likely uh, yeah. outcome from and that. you have more information the more information you have the more yes. likely you are to make the, the best move exactly um, i'm just going to find out whether the rest of the rocks are placed for the rest of the players and we can get this timer started all right So Nathan, when you say um, you wouldn't drop intel, what were you re referring to? Is that intel on Manaru or the possibility of intel on Whisper? Okay, so we're pretty much uh, starting. All right. um, so Nathan says that you wouldn't drop intel. So I think with enough practice uh, and with, um, I mean, me personally, um, I would get to the point where I feel confident enough in guessing people's moves because either you're guessing people's moves adequately enough or you're forcing them to do something that they normally wouldn't do um, or something that's unpredictable, which is usually... Uh, subpar or not as efficient as it could be mm -hmm. so I think um, I think dropping Intel agent wouldn't be a bad thing because um, you know you're not really losing that much you're, you've still got the beneficial uh, component of iron projector or you know depending on what you drop um, I don't think it could be that that detrimental to your list yeah. um, I, I mean you know obviously with enough practice and Tim is definitely a player that could drop intelligence agent like he's a uh, very, very calculated and uh, an adequate player so that's my opinion. He's already at 96 points. He's, he's well and truly winning the initiative bid. Why not just throw that extra yeah. crew on there for... Exactly, that's yeah. right. So, I mean, I'm just saying, the whole the whole, uh, the whole whole initiative bid contest there, that, and that the whole the, the conversation there was just, if we start seeing popular rebel lists or popular imperial lists that are getting down to, say, 95, mm. then um, they're probably the first upgrades that would go. You know, we yeah. would see a drop in intelligence agent and iron projector, um, and you could get down to 93 comfortably and not lose that much, is what I meant. Mm. Um, so, yeah, it's, it's definitely... Uh, it's definitely it's definitely interesting i don't think that scum can be beaten on the initiative bid currently oh so they're both taking the uh slow but steady um approach to this uh manaru bumping uh is that old t i think that's old t. must be old yep. t because he's moving first yep yeah so the darker uh ship is fenrau so morgan not playing that conservatively right now um that's really interesting very interesting mm. So, I mean, he can still keep the shuttle in the corner. How integral is the shuttle in this match, Ryan? That's a good question. Um, I think I think the Emperor is integral. Mm -hmm. um, whether Morgan decides that that means the shuttle needs to be just kept at a safe distance, just if, if uh, Scum's looking to go along the bottom and then come up the right side of the board and he'll just bank off to the top and down the left and just keep keep the uh shuttle out of the game the entire entire time yeah yeah um, absolutely i mean I, I i i firmly believe that the inquisitor 
uh, can win this match by himself. Um, yes. Because if if the Fang Fighters can't close the gap, then basically they get no benefit from being anywhere else. Um, so, and they, they're quite they're quite <laughs> they are very fragile. Um, yes. With a lack of uh, evade token and, and a lack of. Um, auto thrusters so it really depends i think particularly against a list that can really control range and sort of keep in that uh two, range two band oh absolutely yeah, yeah absolutely i think um tim needs to prioritize and remove inquisitor as, as fast as possible mm. which isn't easy with uh, emperor palpatine on the board so i think if we see um palpatine not go down um yeah i think we're gonna pretty much lose um lose a fang fighter yeah the other thing with the the fangs is with with, with emperor um they have no shields you can get some really game-changing crits through on the first engagement yeah yeah absolutely absolutely so uh i i, I like uh Noncron's, uh comment here that somebody chose their match up poorly but uh can't wait to say see which one all oh, right <laughs> <laughs> <clears throat> yeah it's um <clears throat> it's gonna be an exciting match uh and arc dodging aces which is something we rarely get to see these at the days moment. yeah absolutely now we had some interesting matches to uh to choose from but we thought that giving you guys uh complete dog fighting would definitely yep. be the way to go i mean obviously manner is different but uh so gellen um is saying go queensland so um there we go Good on him. He's one of the uh, one of the Magic Vault locals. Oh, is he? Yes. Okay. We got a, we got a uh, solid group here. We got um, a good seven or eight tables running on a Wednesday night. That's absolutely. Uh, if anyone travels uh, for for work in in Queensland, absolutely come into the Vault on a, on a Wednesday night. We'd be uh, happy to have you. Get in a few couple games. So does Morgan go right and continue along the top of the board here with the shuttle just to try and close the distance because. Ideally, he can feed these aces, uh, assuming that he stays out of old Terox ability. Mm -hmm. uh, he can kind of feed these aces toward this list and not really be punished for it. Um, the only risk would be getting flanked by Fen on, say, the Inquisitor. But even then, uh, I don't really see how Tim tackles uh, such a tokened up um, ace with a shuttle. Mm. Um, Fen will have to do a lot of work here, and I think that's. Yeah, so my pick would be um, Fen going for uh, the Inquisitor. <laughs> yes. And the Inquisitor probably going for Fen. Um, I think they're probably the things that need to go first. The Inquisitor absolutely needs to go. Um, and for Morgan to be completely safe from Fen, um, that needs to be removed as well. Because once, once yes. Fen's gone, Whisper just goes on a rampage. Absolutely. She just uh, she just destroys face. Morgan not committing one direction or another for the for the shuttle. If he thinks there's an opportunity, he may uh, bank in towards Manaru. Otherwise, he'll just bug out and uh, keep the shuttle safe. So uh, non run con. Uh, yeah, you 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 may have missed a, a little bit of the uh, the discussion. We're we're saying that there isn't a necessity for anything more than a four point bid right now. But if we say saw um, rebel interceptors or imperial interceptors start to say have a ninety five point bid due to some ship choices, then scum are still in the position to win the initiative bid because they can drop comfortably down to say 93 mm -hmm. um i mean you can see in tim's list he could drop intelligence agent and iron projector without losing too much um uh, 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 utility from his list uh so that that's where we were mainly going with that conversation we don't we don't think that no one it needs to happen but say i don't know with this the silence are coming out um for some strange reason we get a 95 point popular list um emerging that'd probably be um, what what I would drop first from Manaru. So Morgan's hard turned with Whisper and then barreled her back towards the shuttle, just uh, sort of keeping everything at a, at a reasonable distance, waiting to see where Fen ended up. Yeah, I think keeping Fen isolated here is the wrong move. Um, we can I, definitely yeah. see a, a, a like a three turn toward us uh, and then a boost to, to try and get back into formation. Mm -hmm. um, but at the moment, Morgan is able to decloak to the left or decloak straight ahead yes. um, and kind of either continue down the, the middle trajectory or just 
join up with the Inquisitor and try and, you know, tear Fen a new one. So, yeah, it's a mm. dicey position. I would really want Fen to be back with my ships now. Um, he definitely can't play the reposition game as well as these Imperial Aces. Um, but Terok is a bit of a dead weight, I feel. He's not really going to be doing that much in this match. No. Um, so he's stripping tokens, but... Oh. Inquisitor's gonna keep well out of his ability and uh, Whisper should be well out of his arc yep. moving after him. So he doesn't need to be in arc. They need to be in arc of him. Arc of him and, and range, range one. one. So uh, he doesn't need to have his arc facing them. But if they're in range one and he's in your firing arc, right. then, then you yeah, you get stripped. Yeah, if yes. you're inside its firing arc, it discards Strip all focus, all focus and and So that's big because um, it basically punishes Whisper for playing well. Yes. Does that make sense? It's the yes. only ship that pl that punishes your opponent for playing well. So mm. um, you always have to be at range two, which is arguably the best range when tackling a Fang fighter. That's but, true. Uh, yeah, it'll be it'll be interesting to see. I think Fen needs to come back to yes. the fight, and yeah. Manaru needs to start slicing down the middle of this asteroid field so she can drop um, drop some 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 nice uh, rigged cargo shoots. Mm -hmm. So what does Morgan do here? Does he de does he decloak forward to the side, or just not at all? Just does a one hard turn and uh, sort of continues the wait and see approach. I'd probably um, decloak forward and then do a turn. Yeah. Uh, and then just to threaten Fen. Yeah. Yeah. Just to threaten Fen. See, I think re re like rejoining the inquisitor who can definitely slow move at this point uh, mm -hmm. and it's also quite good for the shuttle oh no he's actually done a really quick move there with the shuttle very oh. interesting okay uh so, yeah so i think um kind of going up the flank uh yeah. rejoining forces with the inquisitor to really punish fen for being isolated would be my pick um i think he's done a turn maneuver um i'm really hoping that tim um has decided to come back um toward Manaru and and old Terok. Yeah. But uh, what would you guys do on on the chat? Um, would you be kind of rejoining forces? See, Tim's really playing toward the bottom right of the screen. I'm not entirely yes. sure if that's uh, the best thing to do. You you can't wait for the Inquisitor to tear your to tear your to tear your list apart. Mm. Um, the Inquisitor can absolutely punish these ships in a in a, a truly detrimental way. So, yeah. So, let's see, where's Inquisitor gone? Maybe a, a one bank? I'd probably say a two forward or a one bank, yep, that's yep. right. See, the thing is now Whisper can say two or three hard mm -hmm. um, and either cloak or decloak. Yes. Um, I don't think he can get a target lock here, so probably just, yeah, a barrel roll back, that's right. Yep. Smart choice. Yeah, and then a three hard, I'm assuming. Yep, there we go. Yeah, see now, now Fen. If Fen hasn't gone back, he's he's in a world of trouble. And mm. Whisper's just in the position where she can go wherever, um, and she doesn't need to decloak this turn because next turn she can do a, a two bank toward the center of the field. Um, yes. She doesn't have a lot of bad options right now. So no, and she's got the shuttle supporting her as well for fire support. Exactly. Yep, that's um, another arc preventing her from being flanked. Mm. What has Okay, yep. So Excellent. Tim's starting to come back, um, maybe baiting with uh, Fen a little bit, but they both play the baiting game. I don't really see... Uh, I mean, if you let the Inquisitor follow you, then it'll follow you, you know? Yeah. Uh, and it'll consistently punish you. So, yeah. Probably a two forward and then a boost next turn. Uh, I think that's reasonable, Boost yeah. to the right or a barrel roll, doesn't really matter. You could do a three forward and then a barrel roll around the rock. Uh, mm -hmm. to, towards us, toward the bottom of the screen. Yes. Um, and then you can start kind of jousting down the middle of these lanes with uh, with with old Terok, and then hopefully punish uh, punish an Imperial player that tries to outflank you. The shuttle's in a interesting spot now. It can't it can't hard stop. It is stressed. It's going to take additional stress next turn, pretty much no matter what it does. Um, yeah. It has to keep moving forward. I think you either. Uh, you could probably safely go for maybe a uh, a two bank to to the shuttle's right, so away from the screen, right. and then kind of feed between those two rocks at the top. Um, Does that block your whisper though? So whisper's not cloaked. 
Yes. So Whisper... So then the shuttle will move before Whisper repositions at all. Yeah, that's true. Um, maybe... Yeah, I, like the thing is, Morgan... I don't think Morgan's in the position to, to bank to the left of the shuttle. Um, because no. um, then it just gets isolated and, and, and destroyed. Um, and he's got he's got no need to commit the shuttle exactly either. exactly. The Inquisitor's probably just slow rolling again, yep. um, threatening uh, Fen with uh, one banks. Um, yeah, I think maybe a uh, like a like a one forward with the shuttle. I can't quite see the angle um, because mm -hmm. yeah, the nubs are a little like a little bit hard to see right now. But if he did a one forward, I'm not sure if he'd land um, a one or a two bank next turn. I think he might land a two bank um, toward the right. Um, Possibly, yeah. I see yeah. That. So, I mean, he could do a one forward now or just a one bank and then a, a two bank with whisper. I think a two bank with whisper. That might be fine, yeah. Would be should, fine if you do a one bank. Hmm. But yeah, I'm not really sure of the game that the shuttle wants to play. It probably just wants to consistently feed uh, these aces tokens. And I, I really think, I, I've said this before. Um, the Inquisitor's in the in the position where it can just, yeah, completely remove these Fang Fighters. Um, so Tim needs to jump on the opportunity to remove the Inquisitor as soon as possible. And I think that means you have to remove the Omicron, mm -hmm. um, which, I mean, allows Morgan to bait with it, um, which is probably what he's doing. He's probably driving it through the middle there to, to try and absorb shots, waste Tim's time, uh, drive it away, then bait and switch with the Inquisitor. Yep. Um, because to get close to the shuttle, I mean, you can see um, the Inquisitor's on the other side. So mm -hmm. to get close to the shuttle and do, you know, the proper damage that uh, the Fang Fighters will do, you're probably going to be receiving a range three shot from the Inquisitor, yeah. um, which is, you know, by all accounts, range one. And that would be the, the worst outcome for Tim is anywhere where the shuttle takes damage and then bugs out yeah. without being destroyed. Exactly, yeah. Um, it, that's uh, an amazing strategy with the with the shuttle is sometimes just driving it straight up the middle getting one shot off and then running off into the distance on on uh, just just a little over half half health yeah that's right so I used to play an Omicron group pilot with uh, Emperor Palpatine and um, reinforced deflectors yeah uh, so with Sun Tier and the Inquisitor and that was so much fun because you could do exactly that you could drive it straight forward and mm -hmm. for every third damage you get um, you just <laughs> you grow a shield back. So yeah. I thought that was fantastic. So he has actually decided to commit the shuttle. Um, I mean, yeah. If he if he catches Fen, that could be yep, he really, could catch Fen, really yeah. big. Um, but I think Fen can just do a two forward and then a, a barrel roll, or a three forward and then a barrel roll. Mm -hmm. um, yeah, so it's a two bank with Terok. A three bank with Terok, three. okay. So we're, we're looking, that's why I think going the other way with the shuttle might have been a better idea, but if he can drive the shuttle through without actually getting killed, um, then yeah, I think we're in the money. Yeah. Interesting he's gone for that. Oh, I guess, yeah, that's definitely the best place to be, isn't it? Range one. Yeah. Get the, get the free evade token. That's the he's thing though, the so can the Inquisitor get a range three shot on Terok right now? I don't think so, but maybe he boosts forward and target locks. <laughs> that's right Casey so Casey just said that uh, it's uh, set to be a great game Hart says that New South Wales will snatch it uh, but Morgan is Morgan so we'll see we'll see what happens so he has got a tiger lock on Fen so he's continuing the threat on Fen um, I think Fen's done a done a three forward barrel or two towards us toward mm -hmm. the bottom of the screen toward the timer um, mm, very interesting what is whisper doing Two bank, perhaps, just uh, plop in there behind the behind the asteroid. Could um, be a two hard to yes. try and kill Terok, but that then doesn't that doesn't give you much give space you, to decloak. No, it doesn't. Yeah. I think two bank might be the might be the move. I I don't know. I guess there's some uh, some some beautiful magic happening with uh, the shuttle, but I feel like going the other direction might have been the right, like a maybe a, a better play. Um, okay, so three banks, three good. Bank. Yep. So we should Ooh. have Ark on Fen, and then we we've got a lot of you know, left and right room to decloak um, behind the shuttle and then maybe bug out um, yep. or, or do like a, a big four forward um, afterwards. Yes. So this is all going to come down to where Fen goes. Yep. So yeah, he's, he's, he's oh, mate. <gasps> Dear, dearie me. 
I would have picked the. Uh, Oh, mate. Jeez. Oh, jeez. So close. I thought that the, the, the move there was definitely a three forward and barrel roll um, around that asteroid. That is terribly scary because you'd be basically in the same position. Yes. Um, <laughs> goodness gracious, Tim. You gave me a heart attack. <laughs> so Whispered has arc on old T? Yes. Yes? Yeah. At range two? Yeah, uh, which is punishing. Uh, and a big roll, oh, wow. a huge roll as well. And uh, he palped a crit. Yeah, so that's that's not good. It's range two, um, and what have we got? Uh, okay, so we're taking a crit. That's right. not the worst move in the world. Um, Just depends on the crit. We've used Emperor Palpatine, so the shuttle probably won't do a whole lot. Um, but yeah, I mean, now Alteric's in trouble. Um, mm absolutely in trouble so there's there's a, any number of nasty things that could end thrust control fire oh no receive a stress token so that's not everyone good. receives a stress token yep. which isn't the worst um i mean you can uh, the thing is terox in a in a real bad position he um, is. the other thing is against someone like morgan re reducing the op your options like your dial is limited down to the greens mm. that that's a lot of knowledge that he's just gained. So uh, Tarek just, uh, oh, I think nice. he did three damage there. Yep, three damage. So he did four. Um, did four and then... And then Morgan evaded one, so. Right. Oh, no, only two. Sorry, guys. Right. And... And Manaru, Manaru will have, have a range two shot through a rock, I believe. Yes. So 2v2. It'll be really interesting to see what happens with... Um, with uh with the shuttle shot yeah yes i think that'll make or break it so we've got an aggro mech being spent uh no evades so yeah one shield left on the omicron mm -hmm. um but you know th that's the thing if if morgan had have gone the other way yes um the three bank wouldn't have fit which likely means that old Terek would be out of range um but with a roll like that that's what I mean. I think yeah. the shuttle is now committed. Uh, the shuttle is now in trouble. Mm -hmm. um, probably doing a one forward, which means the two banks won't fit to try and remove the stress. I don't believe the... Would a two forward? No, a two forward wouldn't fit. A three no. forward might, but we might be clipping the asteroid. I think yeah. a three forward is probably the best move for um, for old Terok there. Uh, one forward... Oh, Manor is in a dicey position as well really dicey that 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 thrust control fire was massive this yes. is this is the issue with the tiny mind link and oh no that was last match don't worry i thought we had rebel captive on whisper no no yeah. we don't mm. so what have we got manaru manaru's dial let's 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 take a look yeah so, so two forwards and everything to the left is green yeah yeah and I guess you don't necessarily need to do a uh, a green maneuver with the the star fighters, uh, uh, the protectorates, but probably uh, not. You could probably bump the shuttle, but the thing is, if you do that, um, Inquisitor is going to kill you. Yes. So, yeah, well, one of the two. I think. I mean, the pretty obvious choice is a, a decloak toward Tim's side of the screen, mm -hmm. and then a, um, a one hard. Um, to make the to just finish off old Terok. Yes. Um, Terok could probably go too hard to the left and then boost around, but the Inquisitor's just going to catch you. Like I don't think Terok's in a particularly good place. No, I guess Manaru does a one bank. Fen does a two hard, so that Manaru can pass off that target lock he's just earned on the shuttle. Manaru could go forward, uh, assuming that Fen doesn't bump, because mm -hmm. then if he goes forward then he can like receive a, a focus token from fen yes then can pass off the focus token to fen and then get it back so yes yeah. and, the, and the target lock so, yeah exactly yeah, yeah yeah so uh that's probably the thing is like the stress is is important maybe for terok uh terok mm -hmm. wanted to get the hell out of there um but there's nothing really that he can do against inquisitor inquisitor it is either going to go too forward yeah or uh and then boost and barrel roll to to maintain a shot on fen uh, sorry on terok yes or just um yeah just like go one bank to the right to inquisitor's right mm -hmm. and just kind of trail around there's such a responsive a number of responsive moves that can be done here um 
Yeah, it's it's dicey. And you're right, uh, non-Ron Con. Um, yeah, Fen wants absolutely nothing to do with the Inquisitor. Yeah. Yeah, Fen does like the Inquisitor just fine when he's bumping. Yeah, so we'll see. Manor is not in a particularly good bumping position right now. No. Um, I think the thing is, though, if you, if you again, isolate Manoru, then it can, exactly the same thing can happen to Manoru as, as is happening to the shuttle. It's just uh, kind of getting picked on and, and removed very quickly. Um, mm. Tim's in the running if he can remove uh, the Omicron very, very soon. Yes. Um, but if he chases it and doesn't do any damage, then yeah, yeah, that's the thing. He's only got kind of one more shot. Yeah, one one more chance. Um, do you one bank to our left, which is Morgan's right, with the shuttle? Mm. Block that pathway off for old Terok. If, do you do you go toward our right? So you one bank left with the shuttle. So to towards Tim's side of the, oh, okay. the map, and just sort of if you as so long, uh, assuming you survive this turn, get out of there. Yeah. You, you're safe forever. Or do you turn in and just try and get dice on? Might just do a one Fen. forward here. Yeah. Um, but the thing is, yeah, then Fen. I don't know. It's either it's either a one forward or a one bank right. So right. toward our left, um, because yeah, you want to get out of there if you don't die this turn. Any, any move you do probably either results in a bump or no shots from Terok. Mm -hmm. um, so you're really just looking at Fen and the the, the, the Manaru. Um, I'm not really sure. What do you do with Whisper here? Now that's the question. I, I assume you have to decloak her towards Tim's side of the board. It, it, distance is always pretty difficult with, uh, with these cameras. It, potentially you can get Whisper in behind the shuttle the shuttle do you do that though if you're bumping probably not and oh so intelligence agent has triggered on uh on the shuttle right yeah so i think you you, you wouldn't want to decloak behind the shuttle because then you're in uh, in danger zone yep yeah darby nope. manaru is not in a great spot to get in on the aces um and Morgan's one banked in yeah. the fence. So that's what I think. I mean, yeah. that's probably a good idea. And that's why he wouldn't have uh, decloaked behind the shuttle. Yes. Um, it it really limits the, the, the moves that uh, that Terror can do without bumping um, and allows... But the thing is, you, you're giving Fen an evade token. True. Um, because he's just going to be able to, like, range one you. Mm, it's dicey. <sighs> This is going to be really hard to... I think uh, they're trying to figure out if it's going to go on a rock. I don't think it'll go on a rock. Okay. Okay. I don't know what they're doing here. They're, uh, they're trying to make the, the train track. There we go. Yeah. Just get that angle square on. If Fen doesn't too hard and risk getting lit up, then what's he doing this game? Yeah, that's what I'm saying. So yeah. by by banking in that way, um, you're giving Fen the title trigger, yeah, um, and you're giving him a reason not to follow you through the rocks to be shot by the Inquisitor. Mm -hmm. I think maybe yeah, uh, kind of begging him to go into the rocks to to be targeted by the Inquisitor might have been the right move there. But yep. the shuttle's toast, I think. Um, because what you've said is Manu is going to be able to pass the target lock off onto Fen and five dice with a focus target five lock. Focus, yeah. um, so it's pretty dicey. Do you think a three forward fits with uh, with old Terok there? Possibly, but we're, the angles angles difficult. Does he does he land on the rock with a three forward, or is he fine? Interesting move uh, with one half. that one. I'm very surprised wants the range one shot be stressed too hard oh. but that's the thing i don't know if too hard allows you to uh to get that range one pass over um it's very scary well i guess he has oh yeah so we're gonna have a three forward here from terok yep he's fine he's made it has he yeah he has made it yep yeah. absolutely okay yep so what does terok do then because the inquisitor is going to eat him 
But where's the Inquisitor going? Because he has to move before Whisper. Yeah, so that's true. Um, do you boost forward and try and block a... Well, either A, block a... Um, three forward. A three forward by the Inquisitor, or at least be at range one. Mm. Mm. Interesting. Yeah, I'm not actually sure. That's uh, that's a very interesting point. Um, or do you... I mean, at this, at this point, we almost guaranteed Fen's doing it too hard to clear the stress and get the focus for everybody. Yeah. Um, but is it range one of Menaru? That's my question. That's... A, that's I don't think it is. Yeah. So I think Terra kind of needs to do a focus here. Yeah, he has. Yeah. Right. Because that means Fen can reposition if it's not range one. Yeah. Um, but the Inquisitor, yeah. I think he's doing a straight. Yep. Right, three straight. And now, now he can kind of dictate whether... <laughs> Whether old Terox range, you know, one or two, one or yeah. two. However, he might. Yeah, he's going to have to go after Fen. I think he's switching up because if he goes closer to Terox, mm -hmm. then he discards all his tokens. Unless yes. mm, he could do a barrel roll and then a boost um, toward Tim's side of the screen. Yes, uh, and then he's open to one and left hard, like so, one left and right hard turns. Yeah. Um. Crinus, yeah, it's uh, yeah. So we might have this boost barrel, or barrel boost, I should say. Um, He's still got the target lock on, on Fen, so uh, from previous turn, I believe. Yeah, yeah. No, you're right. Yeah, see, he's going to just start putting the pressure on Fen. Yeah, this is uh, disgusting. Mm. Now, what's Whisper done? Because a one or two hard. Yeah, just yeah. A one hard. Um, so that means yeah. he's still threatening Fen. It's threatening Fen, um, but it's going to trigger Old Terok's ability. Uh, you probably want to barrel roll behind the rock, um, try and get outside of the the range one trigger zone, and mm -hmm. then what you can do is just shoot and decloak. Oh, sorry, shoot and cloak, and then your your options are open again. Yeah. Um, yeah. So he's going to do the barrel. That's right. Yeah. Going back, try and get out of the range one focus zone. Um, sorry, trigger zone for fan, for old Terok. Man, the <laughs> names are not going well. Um, and yeah, um, now he can cloak. Threaten Fen in the future turns. Mm -hmm. Yep. That, uh, He's just trying to tweak the range just a touch there. Keep yeah. leaving enough space to decloak next turn. Really interesting here with mm. uh, Fen. Just a, yep, there's the two hard. Okay, so I think that there's going to have to be um a reposition here he could barrel roll to the right to get at least auto thrusters off whisper yeah um and then manaru can do the shenanigans uh to give him two focus tokens anyway yep i think that's the move that's what i would do i'd, I'd definitely barrel roll uh to the right and forward to try and get a range one shot on the shuttle um yeah and then i double focus and get the tiger lock off manaru get a focus back Take the damage from Inquisitor, um, mm -hmm. and then um, yeah, I'd, I'd get the get the auto thrusters off uh, off Whisper's shot. What do you guys reckon? Um, just streamers? ravaging these protectorates at range two and wow, range just one. Getting you might have to check that range one distance there, mate. Yep, yeah, I don't know if that's uh, maybe it is just definitely range one. Yeah, sure, okay. I all right, so you still got the okay. Tim is just an excellent range judge, so it's it's already range three, so that's pretty good. And he's I guess he's getting the rock from uh, the Inquisitor as well there. Yeah. Um. So that's pretty good. We'll see what happens. Right. So Morgan's just uh, deciding on who he wants to shoot. Is it uh, looked like range one on Old Tarok through the rock, range yeah. two to uh, what is it, range, range three, three with uh, Whisper or uh, Whisper to Fen or range three to Manaru. Mm. He has the target lock on Fen. On Terok. Um, oh, sorry, on Terok. Uh, that seems like the move to go with, unless he's thinking ahead to the next turn. Old Terok's not going to be in a state to threaten him for another turn or two. He wants to fire control systems Fen and threaten him in the next round. That's right. Yep. Absolutely. Um, yeah. I'd probably go for, for Terok. Mm -hmm. You're getting only the focus token. Yeah, there you go. Yeah, um, he's already got the the modifications on Terok as well. Yeah. So we could see a big hit here. It's only range two. Oh, uh, oh, a lot of crits. A lot of crits. All right. So we're but gonna see four dice. dice. 
and he's dodged it with a focus token spend. Uh, very interesting. Mm. Very good. Okay. Um, that was lucky. That was very lucky. That was a very good green roll. Um, yeah. Very, very good green roll. So now he can, I guess he's in the position to go left behind that rock. Uh, he could also talon roll maybe, I don't know. Talon roll behind that rock. yeah, yeah. Um, because the stress is um, not that much of a big deal. Ali, yep. how you going? Your game's over already, is it, mate? Yeah, it is. <laughs> so Ali Gosen from Victoria has just uh, joined us on the stream. Hey, guys, how's it going? Um, so we are just looking at uh, Fen shooting the shuttle here, um, only for three dice on, or two damage, unfortunately. One damage, it seems. Okay. Ooh. No, no, no. This is on. a classic matchup. This is, yeah, we've got no turrets except for mana root, so That's this is fantastic. Sweet. So hit, hit, crit gone through there on the Omicron. So a shield um, and two hull with a shaken pilot, so no straights, which isn't bad, which isn't bad. Um, because the shuttle's probably going to be bumping next turn anyway, so just do a handy. Uh, I'm just, I'm just handy getting my head around everything right yeah, now. Yeah, yeah. So how did you, how was your match, mate? Um, solid. Yeah. You went up. Yeah, I just managed to get the drop on them with cruise missiles, and okay. it just sort of went from there. <laughs> yeah. So yours is the tripper aces with cruise missiles and chips. Yeah, that's yes. right. Yeah. It's uh. This is the Inquisitor on Fen, guys. So we're gonna have a f yeah. Um, beautiful. Wow, that's a beautiful roll. That is absolutely. So we just escaped uh, potential hazard there. I think with Tim. Tim had some really nice green roll rolls there, um, and we could potentially see Manaru wiping out the Omicron. Um, this is Manaru's shot, and I don't think it's going to happen. Oh, that's, that was a really good opportunity. Oh no, hang on. He's well. putting in the uh, the target lock. Oh yeah, with uh, no. still no. With R four. Yeah, bad oh, hang, he can do it. No, uh, he's oh, added, a, added an evade with uh, Palpatine. There, there we go. Oh, that is... That, that's a real bad luck, but I mean... Oh, he's going to Manaru. <laughs> okay. Well, I, I mean, yeah, is that... Who's that at the bottom there? I can't tell. This this uh, Fang Fighter yeah, at the bottom? That's yeah. uh, Fen. Oh, yeah. I mean, Fen's token stacked at range one. Yeah. Don't really have good odds. That's right. So we just lost two shields off Manaru. So this is interesting. Um, I thought that could have been a lot worse uh, for Tim. Um... um. It's a real problem now. Where does Fen go? Because the shuttle is clear on stress. Shuttle can't go straight. But it can stop. It can stop. It can stop. Um, they don't have one banks, do they? No. Who, who, yes. has, who has initiative here? Yeah. Initiative is Morgan. So Morgan will be moving Whisper first. Yeah, so Fen, Fen's in a bit of trouble. Yeah. Um, Fen, yeah. So it was a shame. I think Tim needed to remove the shuttle that turn. Yeah, I mean, I, I agree. I think, uh, I think they would have obviously given a lot of space to work with, but and with Morgan having initiative, that whole left lane is completely blocked off. So, I mean, Fen pretty much has to go right and just, you know, but it's not bad. To get out of this town. The, the issue with the like, so while the right might be, what might seem nice, yeah. Um, then you have Inquisitor consistently shooting you. Yeah, that's right. Inquisitor yeah. is so good against Fen Rao, just being oh, able man. to stay at range and absolutely that title and the ability of course. Absolutely. So yeah, um, we've got a no-brainer one or two left turn uh, with Manaru. Um, Terok could be doing a uh, either a Talon roll or a two hard to the left, um, but that could potentially be blocked by Whisper. Um, do you, do you think Whisper's decloaking left here? Because, I mean, it sets up for a nice bank or straight maneuver to catch out Mana and potentially Fen. It does a few things. Um, it can catch out the Terok any of the two moves. Yeah. yeah um, that's so that's true. quite nice. Um, that's if he decides to Talon roll, he doesn't turn around and now the whole list is stressed. Yeah. Um, so it's it's interesting. I think the, the real one... I think uh, yeah, I would put my money on um, on 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 the Phantom decloaking left because um, then you can get shots on Fen and uh, Manaru, but mm. I'm not really sure what the because see if the shuttle stops and the Inquisitor goes forward, that's yeah. a bump. So I don't know if the shuttle will stop. What if he does a one bank left toward he... Manaru? Uh, no, if Inquisitor does Inquisitor one bank, one bank left. left. I, th I actually think because the one bank left is really strong because it does cover um, all of Fen's left maneuvers. Because Fen could, I mean, if the Inquisitor makes the wrong move, it 
could leave a gap there for them to sneak through. So you're saying one bank left with Inquisitor and Barrel Roll? Yeah. Well, just one bank left should put him About roughly there, yeah. between the between the rocks. He's denying all of that uh, space for Fen to move into. Like a three, like a three hard turn. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yep, that's yeah. a pretty good one. Uh, if the shuttle stays where it is, then Fen's really only left with. Yeah. Turns away, turns away from the shuttle and away from the Inquisitor. Um, so got a few comments from yeah, Darby, your favorite. Yeah, good old Darby. <laughs> Darby couldn't be here, unfortunately, he had um, family commitments, so he had to bow out. But it's really good to see him paying attention. So, non Ron Con, uh, if you turn in and you have a left bank with Inquisitor, uh, I feel like you might be blocked. But again, the guy's playing a tiny mind link, so is a block a bad thing? Probably not. Probably you probably not, I mean, want to bump Inquisitor. I mean, if well, I mean, he, the, probably, he probably wouldn't bump Inquisitor because he'd be moving back and he'd bump into the Omicron. I agree. Then, I think the concern is you'd bump the bump the shuttle and, and then end up with a yeah, shuttle. you'd get a range one on Inquisitor. So that's probably not a bad. Not, that's not, not what yeah. you want to do as the Imperial. That's true. Interesting. Interesting. Let's see. Uh, so, are we going to have a decloak with Whisper? And the beautiful thing for Morgan here is that because he's got initiative. If Whisper gets the first opportunity, gets an opportunity to shoot, he gets one more round left with Pelt, which is just so much value against shieldless ships. Yes, that's a good point. If he thinks everything's going to go to hell, he just slaps that crit onto onto Whisper and does what he did in the first uh, first turn. So yeah. first first crit off the back on Alt T was a uh, thrust control. Fire. Yeah. Oh, <laughs> <beautiful>. <laughs> It's pretty good. You, you don't want to see that in mind. Like, I, I saw uh, um, at the General Games Invitational one time, a ship died and one of the overkill crits was a thrust control fire, and that list was an Atari mind link. Ah, uh, yes, it was just come that's on. That's the worst. It's a bit brutal. Yep, so. Uh, yeah, well, there's, yep. there's the predicted decoy. Good read, Tom. Thanks, mate. <laughs> Um, what do we, I don't know what he's going to do now, but probably a two bank. Yeah, it's going to be a two or a three yeah. bank. See, that's the thing. If he could do this. That blocks a two left or a, a two talon roll with uh, the Fang Fighter. Does that mean Terok is dialing in a 4K? Ooh, damn. I mean, that, that could be strong. He has stopped with the shuttle. Yeah. So, no, I think non Ron Con, you, you are correct. Um, any of those. Uh, that's all fake news. <laughs> Carolina crates, huh? That's the Carolina crates tuning in. Oh, that's great. You missed all of the natties in the last round, crates. Oh, mate, the natties were strong. Oh, I, I, yeah. I, See, I there just, you go. Oh, a block. I just, I just hope oh. I don't embarrass myself on stream when I go up. You know? You'll be right, if, mate. If, I, if, I if you ever make it. <laughs> I don't think I deserve to make it. So that's You'll be right. You're on, what, you're on two and one? Two and one. Mm. I'm, I'm, I'm currently undefeated uh, here in the booth, so mm. there you go. Is zero out of zero, like, undefeated? What have we got there? Too straight. Yes. Oh, okay. More, more Fair please get your hands out of the way, mate. Thanks, <laughs> okay, so we got a two forward. That's really interesting. Uh, was that a, it was not a bump. He's, it was not. He's got all the actions. That's yeah. That's truly <laughs> terrifying. Wow. Um, so Let, let's hope let's hope Tim uh, moved in and gets a shot with Fen. What would he have done? Like a like a three hard bump yeah. the shuttle maybe first. Well, who would he bump I mean, first? Like, a two bank probably bumps you into the shuttle itself, and then you might get arc on on Inquisitor. It's hard to tell. Who do we have the target lock on? Is that from <clears throat> Inquisitor? Has target lock on Manaro? Hey, Jaren. How you going, mate? Three and oh. Oh, Jaren's three and oh. Jaren's joined us back in the booth. Do, uh, do yeah. I have to leave now because he's doing better? <laughs> than Good job, man. Thanks, mate. That was quite TLT as well. Do you want to jump over here? Right. Yeah. Um, okay. This is interesting. Um, oh, so yeah, he did, yeah, he did do the hard. the hard in. So we've had Tim up. Um, we got one hull on the shuttle. I reckon. He, I mean, it's hard to see, but I reckon he's bumping into the shuttle. I don't know. It's going to be interesting. I think he might be bumping nah, Inquisitor. Get, Inquisitor. Yeah. Which is probably the one that he wanted. Either way, he's taking Inquisitor's tokens, which is where he's dangerous. He's got something. He's, oh, that's Fen. Right? That's Fen. Uh, yeah. I was hoping that was Terok. Yeah, but uh, to be honest, uh, Fen wanted to bump Inquisitor because now he just one one shots the shuttle. Yeah, yeah, but not before Whisper gets the the, the big hit on the uh, benefit. Yeah, on Whisper Shatter. flying second or first? Uh, uh, first. first. Morgan has an issue. Yeah, yeah. So yeah, so Morgan's going. 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 Oh yeah, Morgan's going to put damage in. Oh, you are joking. 
That is not the role that he wanted. It's below average, so yeah, it's probably not what you want. Oh. <laughs> Just to rub salt in the wound. Disrespect, Natties. That's, yeah, disrespect. That's disgusting. So we've got the Carolina Crates tuning in. Oh, yeah. Um, Jaren? Oh, which ones? I don't know, just Carolina Crates. That's uh, probably Chris. <laughs> Nothing wrong with Natties. So do you reckon... Yeah, so we've got an ion projector on uh, on Manaru. Do we think that we can we can nab Whisper in the next round? Nah. Probably not. Um, we've got an Intel agent. I don't though. think Morgan has a decloak next round. He does. He's he got does. a decloak. Yeah, yeah, he he got left. To the left. No, can yeah. he fit left? I think so. Yeah, I reckon he can. <clears throat> yep, so we got a removed uh, shuttle. Yeah. Yep. Yeah. So we can, yeah, I think he can definitely get in there. Um, that, this round is definitely going to set Morgan uh, back. Yeah, it's Chris. Hey, baby. So my quad TLT match up to 10. Of the 20 damage cards he takes, I dealt 17 face up. <laughs> that's a the new disrespect, record, right? mate. This is, oh, this is that's that's got to be a new record. It was How, good. Why do you do that to people? Oh, he deserved it. <laughs> oh, that that's only partially justified. Yeah. Manaru from Inquisitor. Manaru just absolutely got out of danger zone. Then that was uh, ridiculous. Well, absolutely ridiculous. So now, I mean. This is interesting because what Ryan and I were talking about at the beginning of the game is that uh, Tim needed to remove the shuttle without losing one of his fangs. Um, yes. because, and he needed to do it without taking damage from Inquisitor. Um, and I think that Morgan may have just committed the shuttle a little bit too early um, and allowed mm. it to be isolated because in the first pass it was down to, um, yeah. to, to four hull. Yeah, that's a brutal first pass. Yeah. Do yeah. not write Morgan off yet. No, 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 absolutely not. Because the Inquisitor can solo this match. Why is he not? Why is he not shooting? Yeah, at Inquisitor can do a whisper lot. here. Uh, um, who is he shooting at? He just measured range on the Inquisitor. On uh, the Inquisitor. No, nah, he shot. He shot whisper. Did he? Uh, and he just lost shields. Uh, are you sure? Oh, yeah, he did too. just wow. lost two shields with whisper. <laughs> Jeez. Still, well, Morgan's Whisper is having a rough day. No, but the thing is, mate, if you make Morgan's Whisper angry, then just it just goes, just goes crazy. I've seen Morgan. I saw <laughs> like Morgan, my little brother. Like, last time I saw Morgan play Whisper was uh, Victoria Regionals last year, and he straight one shot uh, PS10 Corrin. Yeah. <laughs> of natural <laughs> rolls, just five hits. Yeah, that was silly. Instead. So uh, we do, yeah, we do have a rig cargo shoot um, on Manaru. So Oof. we could potentially see a three bank to the right. That's what I'd be doing if I was Tim. Or yep. just doing a one hard to the right and drop <laughs> just dropping it right on Whisper's Just face. depends, because well, if he decloaks to the left though, right? Yeah. Then I don't think the one hard rig cargo shoot. Well, then uh, I mean, you're trying to get ions. Like just, just, oh, right, 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 yeah. just stop Whisper's ability to turn her arc mm. is more important than stressing her. Yeah, for sure. Yeah. yeah. If you stop her from turning her, her arc like, and you get an ion out of it, the and, two and, then, and then retry cargo shoot comes out next round anyway so yeah, exactly yeah. so um with uh, the inquisitor you're probably going to see a one left turn to try and block up a, a yeah a I'll, fang yeah um yeah because the fang what what would Terra, uh, sorry um fen be doing here probably be dialing in a three heart to try and get away from the inquisitor block i'll be trying to capitalize on the whisper block <coughs> yeah. Yeah. yeah yeah absolutely this is what i'll be doing i'll be taking fen three hard to the right yeah, yeah trying to capitalize on a whisper block. Terok? Uh, depends who's going to be your focus man. That's the most important thing with Atani. If, if Manaru is going to do a one hard right and focus, and Terok can do the big um, talent roll, roll yeah. spin around. Get the shots on uh, the Inquisitor, put the pressure on. Or Terok's Ter Ter doing a two turn and Terok's the focus man. And yeah. We're going to see a rig cargo shoot. That's what I'd call. I don't think Terok needs the K turn. It doesn't get him in any quicker. Um, either way, we'll find out. He, he'll do. He'll do one or the other because he'll find out once he intels whisper. Yep. Yep. <clears throat> what are we? There's no room for a two right decloak though, is there? No. What? what oh, he could. He'll just go over a rock. Yeah. Might do it. Probably worth it because if he goes the other <clears> one, he's probably in trouble. He's in more trouble. At least going right. Yeah, yeah. You have a chance of. Because uh, Terra, oh, but it could be. Him. He's out of shields now. Will you decloak right two and three bank right and just go? Well, I'm not going to get shot this turn by anyone. So yeah. 
Yep. I'll just how does play it slow. I'm, I'm so curious about how, how Morgan gets back. There you go. That's the bank intel right. three bank right. So that's yep. what I'm talking about. So he's going he's to decloak right. Go over the rock. That yeah, means it's worth it. it's worth like it. Fen can't get in there. So it's a it's a risk. You know he can roll damage, but yeah. no decloak. Cheeky. So oh, there you go. That's pretty yeah. good. Take the yeah. evade token. But will the recargo shoot get in the way now? Oh no, he's looking for the ion. Is more important. Yeah, yeah, that's fair. Because now Whisper, if, we, if she bumps. We'll wish you probably. Yeah, that, that, I think that should be a bump. Well, it's a bump. Um, Whisper can't turn around again, so hopefully you can get the boys in there. What are we looking at? So that's the focus, man. Mm. That's beautiful. That's a beautiful thing to see. What, the focus, man? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Just a bit of a sprinkle. Yeah. yeah. So he's repositioning, he's trying to escape and reposition. And he's trying to get uh, Manu off the board here, I think. He's, he's, got, to, he's got to commit to The Manu. thing is, he's in a barrel roll here. if he gets rid of Manu relatively quickly, Inquisitor is in a position to be able to wipe these, these fake fighters oh, off if, the board. If he kills Manu and doesn't lose Whisper, I yeah. think he'll win it. Yeah, yeah. I think he's boosting here, isn't he? He'd have to. Or but he could barrel roll. Because the beauty of the Inquisitor is just the, the one heart. Yeah, yeah. Like you're set to follow Manu. Okay, no. no. Either way, you can still one bank next round. <laughs> It's not all. I, just, I think I think the boost gives you better options next round. Keeps you further away from um, Fan as well. Yeah, but now but we're looking also, at a rib cargo shoot. Yeah, Manu has to do a one hard next round. Has he made that? You're joking. You <laughs> are absolutely <laughs> joking. Plot armor. <laughs> Jeez. Oh, I would have picked him for dead. Because now you can decloak right dead for sure. one turn. And he can just what do a, an evade token to soak the damage off Fen. Ah, uh, yeah, you gotta watch out for Manu here as well. Still got that three sixty turret. True, with a target lock on him. Yeah, yeah. It doesn't have a target lock actually. Probably the yeah, two turn. Two turn. I would have picked that for a three for sure. Yeah, just to make sure in case Quizzer. Quizzer, yeah. Well, Quizzer does, does a one turn and he does a talent. It's a talent roll. Oh, stress for the boys. I don't, He's I not ranged one, right? He can't pass the target lock off from no, Manu. No, no, that would be. The trigger begins. Yeah, that might. Oh, that's that's so close to not being obstructed. Isn't Australia supposed to be good at this game? I'm doing all right. I'm three and zero. Yeah. So I, I don't know if I would have done the talent roll there. No. No. The only one I looked at for a talent roll was Terrell. Yeah, and then the three hard I think was the move. Yeah, because he boost boost or barrel fix. Yeah, the boost. Because that there, I mean, don't get me wrong, if Inquisitor did the one turn and he made that talent roll, he's going to probably wreck Inquisitor. Yeah, sure, but on the off chance that he doesn't make it, now yeah, he's, he's just like, like stress, got a stress, stress token, hasn't repositioned. Yeah. Mm. That was that was risky, Tim. Come on. Bring it home. He for also boys. can't follow up Whisper's decloak right next round. Exactly, yeah. Whisper will decloak right in one turn. Fair yeah. I can't follow that. He's got to go left or right and then he can't turn. So this is right. Tim. I oh, don't no. What oh, is going on Morgan just rolled three blanks and two focus. Fenning shooting. Oh no, he's got the evade. Fuck, that's going to be a four roll. That's a blinded. That's a garbage roll. Was that stunned or blinded? Stunned. I can't read. I hope that was stunned because it was blinded. That's now Manor is going to come in here. That is so bad. Well, yeah, well, like, yeah, you make the, there's something to be said about just fucking rolling natties. Tell you what, blinded pilot stayed on my ass first. Oi, so he's definitely getting a, um, Oh no, he might not get a crit on. Watch this double natties. Disrespect double natties. Oh, I, I think he has. Something there. Oh, one. So hit and crit. Shield crit. Well, that's something. Stunned Stunned. as well. Yeah. So that doesn't really matter for. Uh... Well, he can decloak to block. Not this turn, but. Yep. Yep. There is that option there for late game. If, it, if he's still alive. You're going to have for a really poor rolling here for a uh, Manaru. It'll be fucking outrageous if Manaru rolls another. If he rolls another Natties, Quizzer is still in a good spot to follow Manaru and Hose. Oh, though. absolutely. Mm. We, we got, got some blanks. Oh, hit. One yeah. hit. Oh no! Pray for him. <laughs> what? A target lock. Where'd the focus come from? Oh, oh, yeah. from oh, yeah. Atani, yeah. He's due for two. Oh, oh yeah, he's, oh, he's done it. He's done it. Oh, That's natties. brutal. Fucking hell. They haven't Why been kind, that? but uh, they they just uh, they just Why saved him there, mate. Just saved him. Yeah, that was good. That was big. So I think Morgan's probably back in the game now um, because Terra. Uh, sorry, Fen isn't in a particularly good spot. No, Fen's in a garbage spot. Yeah, um, I can't see. It's the angles. 
you know, it's obviously from the stream angle, but I would not say that Fens is a good spot. You can't two turn left. Probably even where would you decloak with Whisper to the right? To the right, yeah, yeah. to the right, and then one her one one turn with uh, with her. Yes, yeah, absolutely. Yeah, that's a that's a nice position. Do you one bank with Manru and just drop the cargo shoot and just yeah. close that entire? Yeah. Oh, Could do. Yeah, yeah. Yep, absolutely. What do you say? So do you trade Whisper for Manru now and then just hope for? No, no you know you want to. You always for alive. Whisper, Whisper can hose. Both Terok and Fen. But that's the thing, uh, you've got, yeah. you, you're not going to be able to decloak if you do a one heart. So you're not going to be able to cloak if you do a one heart because you're going to be stressed from the rig cargo shoot? Well, he's decloaking to the right, so we're well away from it. Oh, true, yeah. yeah. My, God, my bad. You've been doing this all day, Tom. Fatigue's <laughs> <laughs> kicking in. How long have we got left? Uh, 24 minutes here, I think. Oh, damn. Yeah, Morgan will, Morgan will look at the clock and he'll, he'll play for the top full 24. This has been a good game. It's a good, it's an actual match of skill. Yeah. Whereas some of the other combos are just, yeah, my combo is better than yours. Yeah. You lose. Sounds like what uh, you're playing right now. Absolutely. Right? <laughs> yeah. I have a, I have a boost. <laughs> yeah. I have some reposition. I have a reposition <laughs> and a barrel roll. I've got a barrel roll. I mean, I don't use them, but yeah. why would I want to use mine just? <laughs> you're disgusting. Yeah, I'll, I'll take that. All right, so I think we're going to get ready to uh, remove some upgrades off the screen. Gonna see. Oh yeah, every cargo shoot's got to come out this turn. Yeah, for sure. Can in Inquisitor do a two turn left and be the focus man? Inquisitor, what does uh, two forward and a boost to try? I and think just one bank. One bank. Yeah. Just cop there the. Is. There's a one bank. Just cop the stress. Doesn't 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 matter. Oh, he won't. Bank. He won't. Ooh, cheeky. Forward, do cool. Uh, he won't. Um, just, 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 he won't uh, be in range of the rig cargo. I don't think. I think he'll finish shy of it. Okay. Or he's forgotten about it. Morgan doesn't doesn't even he doesn't even rate read cargo because he's never been on the receiving end of a of a brutal one before. Uh, I uh, I was proud of myself. I got a yeah, Poe so. Talon rolling for triple stress because oh, she went over the shoot, nice. bumped onto a debris, and then uh, the Talon. Nice. Does it, does this all translate into Fenrir two turning to the left? There's the rig. Yeah, no, you're right, Journey. He, uh, he makes it. Oh, it's gonna, it's gonna be close. It'll be close, but I think he makes it because Barrel's left. Yeah. yeah. If he goes, yeah, it's two turn. Not happy with that talent roll at all, man. No, it's really put him in a garbage position to back up. See, if he'd done the turn this round, he's one turn in Fenrir. Yeah, and he's like, he's all over. Inquisitor, he could have like, eaten him. Absolutely, yeah, absolutely eaten him. Here it is. Oh, make it. Oh, yeah, I'll do it, make it. Yeah. So if he he could barrel toward the. Fen, I'd just barrel towards Fen. Towards Fen? Yeah, yep. just put the evade on, because he's not going to take any damage from Manu with auto thrusters. Yeah, for So sure. you've got to risk it, because it's better than being, done, being stressed next round and not having any actions at all. Mm -hmm. He's probably looking at the barrel roll right, to be honest. That's if what I was saying. If can clear it right, then... Yeah, he barrel roll right away from Fen, because Fen can't get there close at all. Yeah, no. And then you can go straight really ahead. Strong. Yeah. Uh, I'm not entirely sure, Crow, if the uh, the Bostender match is finished. Do you know about that, mate? Um, I think it was it was next to me. It looked like it was in the Dengar favour. Dengar favour? All right. Yeah, I think so Hector was in front. Anyone that's on the stream right now, you can look at to uh, Tabletop Tournament. We've got the whole match being posted. Um, I can have a look for you right now. Look at that. Uh, let's refresh this guy. So I don't submit my results. I hope my opponent did. You trying to undermine my tournament, mate? Yeah. <laughs> there we go. Where are we? So we had actor. Jesus. Where are we? Uh, doesn't look like it. No, yours hasn't been submitted. Where's oh, actor? I'll go out and take care of it. So I've got a heaps of time. Uh, yeah. yeah so no, um, it's pretty easy to remember. It has zero, not anyway. the the boss. <laughs> oh, the yeah, boss has yeah. not finished. Well, you've got uh, uh, got word from Iceman actor beat. I got the Adam. draw. I got the okay, draw actor me. beat Adam. Um, so that's New South Wales getting uh, a win. one up on. Queensland. Travis looks like he's about to win against Ben. Okay. Yep. Um, he made a move that made it by like less than a millimeter. <laughs> <laughs> if he makes it, he wins it. If he if he doesn't, he loses. And he made it and pretty much removed two defenders in one round. Oh, Holy God. crap! That's crazy. See, Fen's in a in a rubbish position right now. No amount of boosting or barrel rolling is getting there. Yeah. 
so anyway. Maybe out of arc, but... Yeah. Well, Whisper's not shooting, so there's, yeah. no, there's no downside to it. But the problem, I don't think he doesn't... Oh, that might actually be in arc. Maybe. That's pretty tight. Maybe. Maybe we should just eat all of our words. I think we just got to let it ride, you know? Whisper doesn't have a shot. Ooh. Oh, no. Not no, in the no. He's out. He's out. Whisper's still in a fine position, though. No, as long as she doesn't bump anything, yeah. she's not going to die. So, we do have a rock, unfortunately. <laughs> Watch this, triple natties. Stop saying it, mate. You're jinxing it. <laughs> I know what happens with Manaru. It always happens with Manaru. I don't, I don't know. That's not my experience with Manaru. So, Tajay lock, hit crit. I believe uh, ta um, Whisper has uh, Terok locked, mate. Oh, Ooh, hello. The crit goes Got a crit. through. Blinded, 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 blinded. What do we got? Thrust, thrust control. Ooh, again. Again. Yeah, yeah, that's the second uh, that's thrust control fire. This yeah, guy needs right to up. shuffle his deck. Man. Who's more than his target lock on? Uh, Terok. Yep. Yeah. Terok down the bottom. Triple stress. Don't you just like having a full board Mara Jade two times a game? Oh, yeah, it's pretty annoying. Yeah, it's pretty good. Mara Jade? Yeah. No, I haven't no, heard no, that no, upgrade. That's a name I haven't while. heard in many <laughs> 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 I haven't been oh, called that for a long time. One hit on Inquisitor, time. evade, doesn't go through, doesn't yeah, give a no. fuck. <laughs> <laughs> Didn't even roll. <laughs> my, so favorite like, my favorite time was, time, yeah. like, I'm not. my favorite part is uh is just when someone rolls like one hit and you've got Palpatine, you just put the dice there with the with the symbol. <laughs> I don't care. <laughs> I don't give a fuck. Yeah. Bang. Mm. yeah, so Whispers damaged but um i mean that thrust control fire is massive because now whisper can go toward uh uh well, fen, fen and just not gonna sh get shot yeah. you got what i don't think either of the fang fighters will be able to get a shot on uh whisper this turn uh um, whisper suddenly terrox on two position. three health or i don't know i'd be looking to jumping over the rock well either two turning to the right and he's the focus guy but the downside is that he can't 4k fen now yeah, what he, yeah what exactly what his big option was yeah it was massive. that's what yeah. tom just said i'm so just doing a two forward on on whisper because there's fuck all finn can do about it yeah and then barrel to respond to to terror yeah because yeah. you've got the target lock already target lock. Yeah, you're good to go we got some more updates so uh trav did end up being ben what, what was the score uh good question i don't know if it's up on ttt we're just uh, relying on our uh, producer here and uh oh 100 zero cool travis is not <laughs> travis is Three games in, three and oh, 600 MOV. Oi! Well, you said the Wales looking strong then, mate. Yeah, and, well, uh, Tom got one up on Vernon, though. Oh. Yeah, so it's a tough match for Vernon. No, I'm, I'm fucking Wookiees, mate. <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh my god. Why went a measly 464? Like, come, come on, mate. Go home, mate. <laughs> all right. <laughs> I'm flying home right now. No, we're all, we're, we're, we're just going to thank the shops so much uh, for putting everyone up here. And um, yeah, then I guess we're going to. Gonna shout all the boys some beers oh, at the yeah. pub tonight. It's well, gonna be a good time. Uh, Tim and Travis were both going into this round with perfect MOV, and it was whoever lost MOV first has to buy the first round of beers. So oh, I like that. Tim's buying beers. <laughs> Two forward with the there Inquisitor, is like, which is hey, uh, fine. Would Morgan be buying beers because he went half on uh, Omicron for us? But no, Tim's gonna buy beers because he lost the MOV. Travis is still on perfect. Oh, MOV. sorry, I've got mixed up between the games. Never mind. <laughs> Why do I? Why, those why are you here? Man, like, <laughs> those fucking walkies, like it's 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 like a new version of TLT. Is my biggest problem with it. Yeah, sure. Really sure. resilient, and the next issue with them is that um, when you're looking at these low agility, slow agility meta, they're you know three attack dice with a focus reroll. Like they can push damage. Yeah, like, like they yeah. can push respectable damage. Yes. Tim's making some. Uh, I think that one move with Fen definitely hurt him but uh, he's making some great positional plays with uh, Manaru here just oh, really pre pre oh, pre preventing what oh, have we got he's decided he All wants right. to stress fair enough so I feel like that's not great because now Whisper is going to eat uh, Terok yeah. if we're going to two forward like you predicted Joan um, it's not good no it, oh, yeah I guarantee Whisper's doing a two forward or two bank right hold on a second was that just a one turn from Terok yeah why was yeah. the stress from it uh, that's a good point um Let's see what happens yeah uh, if, if the table's listen can you get the stress back on yeah can we place? yeah just um isaac just make sure that the stress gets put back on some people man some people they're just goddamn cheaters cheaters everywhere <laughs> team uh, the next round. microphones off instant dq you know out of battery probably 
I mean, yeah. like, that would be the way to do it up here, wouldn't it? Yeah. Yeah. Yep, so okay. the stress is put back on Terra, that's good. This is an excellent <coughs> position for Morgan. Yeah, yeah, absolutely. Um, Terra could be Terra could be killed right here. Uh, no, we've got a target lock. A target lock so two hits so far. Four hits. Four hits. Yeah. Four hits. Terra needs to see two pitches or he's dead. I reckon you'll see him. <laughs> Yeah, he's seen him. Two pieces. See, I called it. I called it. One left. Terok's now in an awful position. So if I was... So Terok's stressed. So Terok's going to do a two-turn right next round. Yeah. And I'd be boosting to try and block this button. Yeah. Well, but the, the, but the thing is, the D-cloak left turn right with a one Where's heart. Where's Fen facing? Fen facing towards the Inquisitor. I think you're just jamming to the Inquisitor right now. Like, just consolidate your, your firepower and try and... Push yeah. him off the board. The thing is, Whisper's on one health with a stun pilot. She makes one mistake and she's dead. Yeah. Yeah, true. but you know, you got to give Morgan some credit that? for flying her really well. That was Inquisitor. Oh, we go. just have to look at game one where he, he lost almost everything except the Inquisitor on one hull and then still took one the game out. He, People one don't shield. respect that, Imperial Aces anymore. They, they should, underrace, yeah. So they should respect them. Especially so in a game like this. should be flying it with cruise missiles? Is that what you're saying? <laughs> well, look at Nate. Well, you respect <laughs> <laughs> Look at Nathan with his, with his Corrin play, and just, it's insane. Good reposition. Yeah. Yes. Yeah, so that was, uh, that was pretty good. But now, yeah, Tim's definitely on the back foot right now. Yeah, so uh, next round for Morgan will be a deep cloak left and one hard. Yeah, easy. And no, it's going to be a bit faster than that. One hard. No, no, one he hard. needs he needs space. Yeah. Because if he bumps up and he's dead. Nobody's gonna chase him though. Not not with a D cloak left. It's just but, no way. but in a position like this there's no reason to risk it. Yeah, I suppose. Yeah. Because then now then you can just go straight ahead yeah. up the tail and that's it. So um, I would yeah. expect to see uh Manaru do a one hard right power roll back. Yeah. And I'm waiting to see if Morgan yeah, that's, sees that, that's that's classic Manaru right there. If Morgan does a one bank left He'll nail nail Manaru this round, and then that puts him in the lead, right? Thirty four uh, versus twenty nine. Yes, I think you could probably one hundred o. Uh, sorry, one hundred seventeen. This, um, yeah, because Fen's Fen's a fragile guy, you know. Oh yeah, absolutely. Especially against Inquisitor, man. Like my goodness. Oh, Inquisitor is yeah. awesome. Like as long as you don't get so fucking, good, don't don't let Fen come in and range one you. Know, like. Inquisitor does better. Alright, so this is uh, this is round three of the 2017 Australian Team Championships. We've got a State of Origin match here. Uh, Tim Hornsberg from New South Wales against Morgan Reed from Queensland. Uh, we have a 4K turn from the Inquisitor. Well, there's nothing Tim can do about it. So. Yeah, that's true. Absolutely. Um, yeah. So we're going to have a probably a one hard uh, 4K turn from the Inquisitor. Um, it definitely puts Manaru in a safer position though. Now, now, still now, now she can respond to it. Yeah, yeah. Still, she can't respond to it though. She can't block that. I mean, she can't block it, but she can at least. I mean, if she's got a left, for example, she yep. can get out of art. But then, then you can't respond to it next turn? Because then, yeah. yeah like, I think, you just, I think you just keep Manaru up and try and consolidate. Do we need to explain the concept of state of origin to some of our uh, overseas fans? Oh, it's uh, every year uh, Queensland decides to pound the living shit out of New South Wales <laughs> in am, football, and that's yeah. that's what it is. Yeah, in, uh, <laughs> yeah. in, in Australian in Australian rugby, uh, we enjoy it every year. Doesn't never gets old. Was it seven times in a row now? Oh, I don't know, mate. It's just it, it's, it's a lot. Just, it's too much. Uh, just, just need to relax just a little bit. Ben, the Queensland team captain, was saying how much he's in, he's looking forward to uh, having the the shield with two Queensland uh, tokens in, in a no. row. I don't yeah. think it's going to happen. He's going to fill the whole happen. side with with Queensland. I don't think it's going to happen this year. That's a good move by Tim. Yeah, absolutely. Let's fuck all we can do about that whisper decoy. So we got a four K turn with uh, the Inquisitor. Hopefully not off the board. Or... Nah. K turn. Uh, I think th th this is rigged. Uh, K turn would be to prevent a block um, by Manaru. Um, not that it would have been the worst thing in the world, but now it breaks the it breaks the consistent block from Manaru. Um, Manaru won't be able to turn right and block the Inquisitor now, whereas the Inquisitor is just 
next turn going to be able to remove mana off the board. Fen, so. Fen is in the worst space right now. Fen isn't great. Fen is not in a good spot. No. I think the, the two talent rolls what really screwed yeah, him up. He was in a fantastic spot to get a three hard that one turn. Did not want to be the main whisper oh. versus Inquisitor sandwich. He's, not done a, he's done another talent roll, has he? Oh my goodness. Oh, he's gone that way. Oh, maybe he's doing all right. Here we go. Cheeky move. Here we go. That that was probably the best thing he could have done in that situation. Yeah. Good read. Very cheeky and Morgan doing... Three hits though. Three damage. Well, he gets a focus from... None of them, actually. It's no focus, man. It's just going to be Nattie's. It's going to be Nattie's. 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 I'm calling it two hits. I'm, not, <laughs> I'm calling it two hits on a focus. If I don't get... If, Range you got to call it as well. Right. If you um, don't get it, you buy me a beer tonight. That's fine. Yep. One. One. There you go. I'll buy you a oh. beer. I don't get it. Oh, oh yes. he's done it. <laughs> Just roll natties. That's it, Nathan Wilcock. Plot armor. Range three hours. Two hits. Not give I think no. Yeah, <laughs> 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 All right. Yeah. So I think uh, next turn, uh, mana is out. Um, Owner has to go. Whisper, yeah. uh, Whisper being followed by Fen now is a bit of an issue though. But you could probably, what, do a one hard to the right and then barrel in to prevent the, the one hard from Fen? Play the range game? Yeah. I mean, that, that would definitely work, but then Terra, I mean, Fen does it too hard. He needs to remove, what he needs to do is he needs to fucking remove Manaru. Otherwise, yeah. this is all pointless. Yep. As soon as he removes Manaru, he can then front. remove old Terok. Well, yeah, as soon as he removes Manaru, he's in front. How long is left? Uh, we've got eight minutes left on the so clock. So just kill Manaru and run. That's yeah. what I'll be doing. So you're looking at a one hard to the right and then bank, uh, blocking the Fen one hard? Is that what you were going to do, yes, Ali? Yes, one or? hard right and barrel roll in. Yeah. Fen can't do anything about it. Yeah. Just a two hard with Fen, clear the stress, get a tar target lock, and then yeah. try and dance yeah, around Yeah, I'll be looking at Fen to try and get a... Um, I, know, I know I've got tunnel vision right now, but just go for Inquisitor with, with, with your Tim. Tear off. You can't, you can't get to Inquisitor. Because he was doing a one hard right, and he's going to go target lock focus. Yeah, yeah. Well, and then well, he's going to absolutely either smash Terok or Manaru, and it's going to be disgusting. That's all good, but you got to play for some yeah. sort of game and not just content, like continuously respond yeah, to your opponent. He can kill, he can kill um, Terok. Like Terok's on one. Yeah, absolutely. No auto thrusters. No, mm -hmm. nothing. Yeah. It's disgusting. Terok is worth thirty points, so that is a he wants it. Oh, he wants he it. He needs it. He's not going to get into range one there, though. It's all about. It's just all about. Rolling what he's giving himself though is range two. Yeah. Although, because I might be able to barrel roll back and get into range three. Mm -hmm. I'd just focus evade. Yeah, just do it. Wouldn't even entertain the idea. Okay. Focus for the offense evade. Like you can't die. Yeah, get, that's true. Get good, Ali. I mean, I'm not three O, so <laughs> I have to shut my mouth. <laughs> now this is. is this has been great. Just play the numbers. It yeah, is. there we go. So then a, a one hard in. Oh, yeah, you could do the, could do the barrel roll. Yeah. No, it's just no, closed. Yeah, yeah, yeah can't, the, you can't the, touch him. Yeah, he's looked at it and gone. You can't touch me. There it is. Nothing. Yeah, the two hard. Oh, two bank. Yeah, All right, or even better. Him. Yeah, beautiful. Four minutes left on the clock. So Morgan needs to pick this talent roll next round. Yeah, off absolutely. Of, off of fame. Uh, uh, perfect roll on probably old Terok. Yeah, boom. it's done. Boom! Yeah, that's see you, mate. Doing it. Fuck, what a tight game. This is a tight game. And bloody... Morgan's target look on Whisper's gone as well. Yeah. Yeah, like two dice. He needs to roll three focus for Morgan to even take a damage. Mm. Nope. Denied. Those don't look like focus. <laughs> <laughs> yeah this is uh that was rough that was a big swing too i think i i, I would probably put it down to uh well to yeah. the talent roll there man uh yeah. the talent roll was cheeky but the thing was he boosted tear off that round so he could have had a focus in the back it not that he rolled no 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 i mean the talent roll when we were in like a few rounds ago like when we, we picked the three like right in the yeah, 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 yeah i think that was the round that he could have really put the pressure on inquisitor yeah, and, and terror could be actively hunting Gave him yeah, too much exactly. space. yeah that's right the, the, the talent roll didn't because it allowed morgan to play around the necessity to go two or <laughs> the thing is well, like right. morgan morgan's got a lot of experience on this type of yeah, table yeah. this table with this type of pressure 
Yeah, yeah, yeah. He'll absolutely. play. Like he'll yeah. play the full seventy five. I think this games. might be like this is like we're streaming to look. Look how many people have tuned in today. That's massive. Nearly yeah. three hundred. Yeah. Um, right. Tim, I think this might be Tim one of Tim's first streaming. Yeah, matches, yeah. He so. hasn't done many streaming matches. Yeah. It's big. It's big. But yeah, no. This is uh, this is a really good game. Fantastic. Are these going to be posted on this YouTube? This is what Morgan did in the um, first game as well. He just turned good around. Question. So I don't know if they'll go so onto YouTube, but they will always that. be available on the Twitch. That's good. Um, that's nice. Yeah. So way Twitch works, the second that the stream shuts down, video will go up. Oh, fantastic. So I can always watch it on Twitch. It'll always be there. Yeah. Great. There Sweet. you go. So that's we can good. post it up to the uh, yeah, other guys as well that make it. It's fantastic. So the, the, all, all the commentary as well is going to be there. Yes. So oh, that's everything embarrassing. that's everything that we're doing now that's going out to people, that's what uh, get, it just gets captured and posted immediately uh, by Twitch. I don't think my voice should be immortalized, but whatever. <laughs> you should probably leave, Ali. <laughs> yeah. So this is uh, even, it's, it's comfortable. <laughs> so like here. this is this could cascade very quickly right now because one big turn on Manu and all of a sudden he's got Manu and is, Serok. Oh, Whisper's in the decoy. Interesting. Well, he doesn't need to. Doesn't need to. Just no. four yeah. dice. Get an yeah. evade. He needs to survive with Whisper. That's the thing, is. Yeah, yeah, it depends on if he's picked the the left or the right oh, talent roll. Oh, cheeky to the talent roll. Yeah, really the talent roll. There was no way that he wasn't gonna like we, not get a shot, right? Correct. If he had a gun, even the right talent, the, sorry, the right talent roll yeah. would have would have had it. Yeah. But what? after the last two talent rolls, could you bring yourself to do another one? Yeah, <laughs> you, got, you got to back yourself <laughs> off. So, yeah. so rude. He might be going for the Inquisitor here. That's not going to do yeah, a lot. He's going to do nothing. Yeah. Range three. We're going to get one more dial though. I think. There's a blank there. Crit, 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 crit. No. Damn. Those marbles. Those marble. Those Mate, marble. The marbles, the marbles are the only things I they're good, use. They're good. Vi they're good vintage. Oh, aren't they? They, they, oh. they, they do well. Boom. I think That's the marbles, the marbles in general are uh, marbles, my, my choice of dice. Yeah. So the marble evades. There's a double, he's dead. Oh, that's not great. Yeah, it's gone. Okay, Even if Whisper dies, he wins. Um, I find the marble evade dice are an excellent vintage. <laughs> you should see <laughs> the Luke, sparkly Luke red King. dice are outrageous. Yeah, yeah, exactly. The sparkly red dice. Yeah, sparkly, sparkly red, red dice are outrageous. outrageous. The only reason that I wouldn't use sparkly red dice is because it looks like a unicorn has shat them out. Yeah. And there's just no reason that I want that in my eyes. No, I don't want that. Me. So now I, got I, marbles, mate. Yeah, I got I got two already, sets of marbles. You already from, got a good from, vintage. Uh, yeah, from uh, from Damn. 2015. Like Zizor. <laughs> <laughs> Zizor Swarm was where it was at. I heard it was all about Fat Han. That's just what I heard. It was all about Fat Han. Uh, there were a few burgers thrown, but um, <laughs> <laughs> but uh, Zizor Swarm had the had the tech to defeat it. So we're about 50 seconds away from uh, end. So this I is actually better be go and report my last round. Yeah, yeah. yep. Cheers, Ali. Thanks, thanks, mate. All right, have a good one. Really um, tight match like this. It is really a tight match. Yep, yeah, absolutely. So I'll, I'll post it to the streamers here um, because we've got the next round pairings, um, and I just want to know what you guys want to put up on the. Uh, Who's Do you need the matchups? Who yeah, have we got next. Right. Uh, oh, you, Melbourne. Oh, Melbourne. Yeah. So yeah. Okay. So guys, uh, just on the stream, um, we've had New South Wales. Uh, this is the second time New South Wales has appeared. Um, but we look the best, mate. Yeah. Yeah. Look right. how good we look. <laughs> uh, so do you guys the stream? Do you want mercenaries in South Australia, uh, Canberra against Queensland, or New South Wales in Victoria? Uh, please oh, comment. What salt, you'd like to see the salt in Canberra right now is outrageous. Yeah. It'd almost be worth just having a listen to. <laughs> Yeah. So yeah, uh, if you guys could comment um, on on who, would, who who you'd like, that'd be fantastic. Is MLV p pulled between rounds? That's a fair question. Uh, it is pulled between rounds. Yep. So we're we're counting up uh, total victories uh, for each team. So let's say you get um, eighteen Four. victories throughout the day, and another team also gets eighteen victories wow. throughout the day. Um, yeah, MOV will be the decider. Thanks, Jaron, for the the commentary there, mate. Uh, good luck. Uh, Rocklow does a quick game, so I'll be in here a fair bit. Yep, no like worries, that. mate. Whether I'm dead or they're dead. Yeah, that's 